It's mom. I'm off work now. Yeah, I, I emailed the one back today. Yeah. I'm going from there. This, uh, this, I'm using, uh, yeah, I use my cell phone and my tablet. It's December the 20th, not, no, the 26th was the eclipse, and the day is the 28th. And today is um, a wine, a wind, a waning moon. No, it's a waxing moon. Excuse me, a waxing. The full moon will be up to I, I, Hold on one second. I have to talk to my manager about something. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I can tell. 
Yeah, I'll get it. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I'll African-American and black, because he looked like he had tears in his eyes almost. In fact, that particular guy um, came back um, like three times in line during this sequence of events. Um, he, he ordered a meal and then he left and then he came back and ordered um, a sandwich and a Hershey's and pie. He came back and complained about the meal. And then, um, then after he came back and complained about the meal. I'm using my tablet. Yeah. Okay. After he came back and complained about the um, sandwich. He said it wasn't right. Um, and so I um, I looked at the, I pulled it up because he, um, yeah. I pulled it up and I saw the, um, I saw the order and, and, and the meal was okay. I did it right. But his sandwich was wrong. Yeah, he looked like he had tears in his eyes. But anyway, it was done. 
So I gave him back the sandwich. I mean, I took the sandwich from him. And after I took the sandwich from him, um, Miss Phyllis told me to refund the money. And then he said that he then he wanted another sandwich. And then and it was a lot of confusion. He wanted the same sandwich from John. So he wanted a refund and plus the sandwich from John. Uh, no, the, okay, hold on, because I don't want to seem like I'm being rude. And once again, I respect her. Whatever she tells me to do, I don't want to say I'm being rude. She said she didn't want to speak to me about what happened. That she said right next to me. Uh, what? Police. 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 Police.
but she came and sat next to me while I'm on the phone with you in the dining room at Burger King. It, it, sound, it sound like she was saying brother, she says brother a lot, but I don't know, that's what it sounds like she says, but I don't know who she's referring to. Just like when on um, some of the videos I hear her say Paige or Peace, I don't know who she's talking to. You know, I, it sounds like she said it, but I don't know. You know, and then, you know, brother, I don't know if she's talking about her brother, I don't know, but that's after, that's when I, all these things start to happen. Like the, the guy, um, she said was rude, and Kayla came out of nowhere, backed her up, and she didn't, and Kayla didn't hear. She didn't, uh, she's a younger um, co worker. I think she only works on the weekends. I, I rarely see her work on the, during the weekdays. I don't know. Hold on one second, okay? against Burger King, except all I have ever wanted to do was implement my constitutional rights and earn money as I continue to correct my status as a Moorish American. Never implied I wanted to sue Burger King and want to sue Burger King. I didn't come to Annapolis to earn money and, and get a job and then sue. Hold on, let me show you all these cameras that are right here. One second, okay? my tablet and see there's one camera there, there there's another camera there and this camera right here is facing that way but this camera right here actually you can see there's another camera right here and then there's another camera right here all these cameras at Burger King It doesn't benefit me to be rude to a customer like that. Especially if I, if I was just told that my personality was not good, but she didn't say because of a customer. She just said, person, my personality. And I told her, even with that conversation, I told her I didn't know anyone. Her, I told her I didn't know her. I never, I know. I said, I rarely have a, a personal conversation with you, Miss Phillips. I don't understand what you're saying. When I, I don't, I do not have, when I come in, I say good day and I start working. I don't, we don't, I don't, I didn't go to a Christmas party because I don't celebrate Christmas as a Hebrew Muslim. We don't celebrate Christmas. Um, Imani Gray Hyphen Bay or Thanksgiving. Our religion, Islamism, and we're implementing um, the U.S.A. Constitution of Abraham Lincoln's proclamations in the 13th Amendment with 20 sessions. So, a lot of things that they might do, I don't know what they do outside of Burger King, but it, it um, that's, I mean, even if they did it, I don't know, but I'm there to earn money. And keep it professional. I, for, you know, exactly. Hold on one second. Um, 
Yeah, well, you know, uh, like I I've always try to bring uh, a vegan vegetarian diet. No, we don't. We prepare our own food because um, that's something we choose to do, and that's that's part of constitutional rights. We want to put our own energy in our own food. I have, we don't eat out barely hardly anywhere. Not barely hardly. We don't eat out anywhere. The last time I ate at a restaurant was probably over two and a half years ago with Imani Great Hyphen Bay. So you know that. No, that's crazy to think something like that. I don't know. I don't. I truly don't understand. But I, um, I don't know her. I don't know Miss Phyllis personally. I don't know anyone that would earn money at Burger King personally. That doesn't affect my job. That's why. I, that's why I wanted to talk to her today. I was like, what could I've done better? What is she talking about? I mean, today I checked the expiration dates on the milk, the orange juice. I swelled. I, I received um, compliments. They, one, one customer said I was nice and it seemed like I like what I do. And so, some customers say you really got these prices um, down packed. Cause I give them, I always tell them I try my best when they add things, how much it costs. I, I truly don't understand what what I did wrong. I f refilled the ice bin. Whatever she, I, no one tells me to do these things, I do it. Today, I don't think anyone told me to do anything that I, I, I just went ahead many times. I just do it. Well, this past, what's today? Saturday, uh, uh, Thursday, for instance, Miss, uh, I think it was, uh, who did I work with Thursday? I think it was James, he told, not James, but Thomas, the other black male manager, he told me to um, go in the um, dining rooms and um, clean the dining room, check the dining room. And I stayed out there and I swept, I mopped, refilled, um, not refilled, but wiped down the tables. And I, yeah, I did refill the lids and um, do all the, and um, make sure the um, trays, now something like that, because I'm a cashier. Yeah, I've been told to do things like that, but if, as for sweeping, mopping, um, condiments and stuff like that, I do on my own a lot of times. So I don't, I, I truly don't understand and I get so many compliments. So when she said that my hours were cut because of my personality and sometimes like I t I'm not sure she said this, but since she was saying brother, I'm not sure. I, you know, I'm not sure. This sound because like, I'm working, I'm earning money. I don't know who she was talking to, and then all of a sudden this happened, and the male seemed they under that status. I don't know if they claim a nationality or not. And that's who they were referring to, saying it, it seemed like they were trying to seem like I was being rude or discriminative or whatever. That's what that and they and she's saying that my hours were cut because of my personality and that's that's why I'm like what if I don't even I try not to argue I don't if she tells me something I do it I don't know it's like I, sometimes she's trying to get be angry with because I've heard people say going on second shift or somebody going on night shift and I'm like I can't I'm not I don't know who they're talking about. Oh, exactly. I don't, I don't, I have never, in all these years, have never um, dealt with Miss Phyllis on a personal level or any of them on a personal level, ever. Most of the people that come into Burger King, once again, uh, you know, you know this, they are the pale skin or those that consider white, they have not claimed a nationality, those that imply or are connected to the United States Navy, the Army, the military, those are um, African American, black, unless they claim a nationality, and the Hispanic. Those are the three main groups that come in the Burger King, I mean the four main groups that come in the Burger King. And then after that, you um, um, from India. But not too little of those, that, um, that ethnicity or that race, or not race, but, um, those that live from that country, not enough for me to even count. But uh, I would say maybe three or four per week. And so 
so and I get and I try my best to give everybody customer service. So anyway, I'll talk to you later, okay? Great customer service. I don't know what we're gonna cook, um, prepare. So um, right now I'm trying to control my thoughts. Yeah, <laughs> so you know we are, yep. Be among a telepath, yeah. Being among a telepathic community. Oh, so many times my genitals are attacked spiritually. As a, I, it could be coming from anywhere. That's a spiritual, so many times while I'm earning money or, I'm experience, or I experience sharp pains. Forcefully, I don't. It could be coming from anywhere, but you know, um, that's dealing with spirituality and the way by today and now we talk about um, we, we in the email previously, and um, what I learned is that's in reference to spirituality. That's under that realm and that plane. So, yeah. Well, I, I, now that video, I didn't know those males that's coming to the Burger King that imply to be or are connected to the United States Navy Army. I didn't know they were going to start saying more. No, I was I was um, doing what I usually do with my tablet, and all of a sudden they just start calling one another more. I have never seen um, a more as an M U possibly U R come in the Burger King ever. They come, they've been coming in there since I know, I don't know, before 2016 and sit there for hours. I have no idea. Now, I, well, I don't know if they claim a nationality. Once again, I know one has the word army on his um, license plate and the other one um, sometimes wear those word navy, but I don't know their history or so forth. Okay, I'll talk to you later, okay? Okay. Well, I'm, I'm well. I just don't understand what, what the animosity is because I know I have not implied I want to talk. I can understand if we had we have hung out or, you know, um, we don't have this. Uh, what I, as far as I know, we don't have the same religion. You know, um, Imani and I are in the process of amending our birth certificates uh, so that um, our birth certificates will have our racial designation of Asiatic so and these things matter so um, um, as Moorish Americans and, and we uh, we went through all the steps of alerting the Social Security card office of um, I changed the status by um, getting um, our name changed and corrected with they the um, we got a, a Maryland state ID with our name changed corrected with they so, um, yeah, we, um, I don't, I, I have never had these, uh, besides what I need to tell them, I, I did tell, um, they, they said they changed it. Um, so, I, you know, I, I gave um, the owner's son, again, a copy of my uh, state ID and my social security card with my ancestral name of Bay. And, um, yeah, yeah, you know, we, as far as I see, um, if we have something in common besides the general, that's it. it yeah, it's like, yeah, exactly. I'm there to earn money. That That is not for me to, I can understand that you talk about the general thing. If it's snowing, how you doing? Um, I need to have this day off. But all the rest of the stuff, it, you know, you do, I'm there to earn money and um, show respect to my coworkers and, and boundaries and I hope for, and I hope the same. It's long. So I'm, I'm okay. I don't know what the religion they are. I have no idea. You know, my our religion is Islamism. Yeah, that's um, Amendment One and um, Section One of the Thirteenth Amendment, Twenty Sessions. So, um, and the Bill of Rights is Amendment One. It speaks to that. So, I don't. I don't. I have no idea. I have never had that conversation with them in that manner. Besides um, the basic, as in telling, I had to tell CJ um, about. Me. I was telling him I'm a Hebrew Muslim in reference to Fridays because. Um, um, he was saying that um, I was telling him that my Fridays I've always gotten off at 3 p.m. and um, or no later than 3:15 p.m. and um, and I noticed he was scheduling me to four and I didn't understand why and over, since 2016 my schedule has been the same but then uh, he said he made a mistake he didn't know 
So the past these past two Fridays, I haven't been on a schedule at all. Yeah, so, yeah, I don't know. He said he made a mistake, but then I'm off the schedule, and, and now my hours are cut. So, okay, I'm going to talk to you later, okay? Um, yeah. Well, I, I wanted you to see the, the canvas because if I'm trying to see, like, I have never implied once again or say I want to sue Burger King. That doesn't make sense. Why? What is the purpose? All that, you know, earning money and implementing my constitutional rights, that's what any um, true American citizen, I would think, who has dignity and ethics would want to do. Which these, yeah, the divine laws of freedom. Freedom, Islam, yes. So I don't understand what, what I have no idea why she, I don't know. I have no idea. That is rational, that makes sense, and that is lawful. Because I'm thinking lawful and rationality, Islam, or a, ra a rational thinking, like, I don't understand. Right, she. That's why I brought up the cameras, cause she was she create. I mean, she said I said she she said I've told the guy like I was how come and I was like maybe she I don't know what what she heard. That's why I brought up the cameras. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Bye.